right guys, welcome back to I Tried My Best Handyman, and today we're going to be doing a little cooking school. I'm fat and I love to cook. Today we're testing out our new Blackstone griddle. This thing is awesome. If you don't have one, get one. All right, I'll keep you informed. All right guys, here's our new Blackstone. The thing looks awesome. It's pretty simple. You get it, you build it, and to season it, it comes coated in a soy oil. So you let that burn off at high, and then you pretty much just lightly coat with oil. I've been using like olive oil because I really care about my health. And then you let that burn off, do it again, and do it about three times so you can get that little non-stick like you would a cast iron. That's what it is. And so far we've done hot dogs, fajitas, omelets. I'll show you the omelets later. Autumn made this morning. And here in a minute we're getting ready to do burgers. Alrighty. I'll show you how it comes out. Bacon. Veggies are coming in. Yeah. All right, guys. The best part about a blackstone, you can cut on the damn thing. So, this is all cast iron. It ain't gonna hurt it. I'm sure, it ain't good for the knife, but. Who cares? Keep a cheap knife to cut on it with. And you are ready to roll. And damn, that's hot. All right, guys. So, for the griddle, we ordered a comprehensive griddle accessory kit. This is just a regular old $50 something off Amazon. Still way cheaper than the Blackstone stuff. Let's see what all we got. Oh, oh, looks like we got a sexy apron. We got some big old thick gloves. Let me put it down real quick. That's super thick, I guess, for grabbing hot stuff. Right. Looks like we got us a scraper. Now coming handy for cleaning. Got us a little, probably bottle to put oil in. A knife, some scissors, a little basting brush. Scoring pad for when you're scrubbing down your blackstone, which is a must. Came with the injector. It feels like a pretty decent little injector too. Well, that's a pretty good thick little injector. And we've got some little shapes you can put eggs in, so you can have heart eggs, regular little circle eggs. 
it looks like a whole mess load of hooks so you can just hang your stuff off the side and a salt and pepper shaker Got a little dome so you can set it over whatever you're cooking. Create another little little lid. Another bottle. Big old flat spatula. That's what we need. Make it easy for flipping stuff. Got us tune and fork. And with the meat thermometer, some tongs, mess load of little bamboo sticks for skewers. Now it says on the pack it's a 135 piece accessory kit, but here's probably a hundred of them right there. I guess it's a scraper, but it also has measurements on it. I don't know what that's for exactly. Got a little tote bag for everything. And another kind of spatula whisker thingy. Alright, that's a little accessory kit we got for our Blackstone. Now to unpack all this crap and put it up. There it is, all laid out. <clears throat> oh yeah. Time to do some cooking.